Hi, this is the Phoenix from Phoenix Rise and Tarot here to do a full moon reading for the various signs. This is for Pisces. Um, these are messages that Spirit wants you guys to have for the full moon that is in Leo currently. Uh, there is going to be a lot of changes for some of you. This could be past, present, or future. Take it however it fits to your situation. Uh, this is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus in the sign of Pisces. Just keep in mind, these are general readings. It's not going to resonate with all of you, but for the ones that it does resonate with, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. All right. Um, yeah, let me see what Spirit has to say to you. Okay, so we have the King of Cups in the reverse. So there is somebody that you could be dealing with that you're no longer in love with. Could be another water sign. Uh, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. And you're ready to move away from the situation very quickly. Because you seem to have been sending messages of passion to someone else. Because in this connection, there has been a lot of fighting, bickering, falling out. Sometimes I feel for some of you this is a literal fight. Mm -hmm. Yeah. At the bottom of the deck we have the judgment. So some of you are not ready to forgive this person for whatever has transpired between you and them. Like I said, I felt that it could literally have been a fist fight. All right? Yeah, and you made a choice to take charge of a situation and look for your own happiness and a brand new beginning without this person. All right, so we have the King of Cups as the overall energy. So this is about you not making a choice when it comes to love. But like I said before, it's like you don't love this person anymore. It feels like you're disgusted with this person. And you're ready to move away from the situation very quickly. To move towards finding somebody else maybe. Somebody else that you feel would make you happy. Could have been a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn you're dealing with, or Scorpio. But in the recent past, this person that you were with could have been older than you. <clears throat> but they were like a mother figure to you. They were very nurturing, caring, kind. Generous. But you didn't want to work on this partnership. You had enough. You had enough of this person because for some of you, this person really was a control freak. They wanted to control everything you did. Everything you said, everything you wore, everywhere you were. And you knew you had to get out of this connection. Although this person gave you the Ten of Cups, Actually, no. To them, you were their Ten of Cups. This is them. This is not you. You gave them happiness. You gave them a home. You gave them a family. And because of this, they became codependent on you and it became very, very obsessive. And all you wanted to do was leave. I think for some of you guys exactly what you did. This relationship became toxic because they were more in love with you than you were in love with them. And then there were lies and deceptions and deceit.
and you felt like nothing had changed with them. But they still want the same thing at the end of the day, four of ones. They want a happy home, happy life with you. But I don't think for most of you, you want that with them. Because they were pretty obsessive over you. And they literally scared you away. Clarify the King of Cups for the sign of Pisces. Clarify the King of Cups for it. Why, is, why, why does Pisces feel... Wow, there are a lot of messages you guys would like to receive, but I'm not taking all of those cards. Um... <clears throat> I'm just going to take them because they keep falling out. Alright, so you were looking for something that would make you happy. You were looking to have your wishes fulfilled. A brand new passionate beginning. Because your situation would not change in any way on form. This person was just becoming more and more obsessed with you. And you made a choice. To stand up for yourself and to end this connection. But I don't think this person really forgave you for that or you for didn't forgive them for that. Clarify the five of wands for the sign of Scorpio. Uh, sorry, Pisces. Uh, hmm. Yeah, you weren't accepting what they were offering to you. Because I, I think they tried to hold on to you. And you made a decision to break free. And to have a new beginning. Is there any more additional messages that you need me to give to the sign of Pisces? Alright. So you're being watched. Probably by this person still. You're being watched. Because this person still wants to rush into you. We have the Page of Swords. Could have something to do with an air sign child I'm hearing. Uh, Gemini, Libra or Aquarius. <clears throat> but this person is still stalking you. For some of you, this, this relationship ended a while ago. Probably about eight months. Or four months but this person is still watching you they're still waiting for communication from you they're still waiting for you to rush in and save them or rush in to tell them that you love them but it's never going to happen for them is it Pisces Just remember, energy is fluent. If you need to switch it around for your situation, you could do so. But I'm not seeing this relationship working out for you and this person, Pisces. I don't think you have any interest in carrying on this relationship with this person. Because all somebody wants is this to end. Could be you or the person you're dealing with. Hmm. Alright, Pisces, that's what I have for you guys. I wish it was a more positive message, but that is what I have for you guys. So, bye.